Hello students and welcome to Top Scholars. Today we'll be talking about another very very interesting and very simple topic that is patterns of biodiversity. Now students, let us first talk about the latitudinal gradients and how it affects biodiversity. Now on our planet, the diversity of plants and animals is not uniform throughout the world and it shows an uneven distribution. For example, the species diversity goes on decreasing as you move away from the equator towards the poles and exactly opposite will occur in the opposite direction. Meaning, as you move from the poles towards the equator, the species diversity goes on increasing. Now, why do you think this is happening? Let us take a look. Students, in tropical environments, so basically when I say tropical environments, these are the environments or the regions lying near the tropics, that is the Tropic of Cancer and the Tropic of Capricorn. In these environments, there are very less seasonal changes. The environment is very much more constant and predictable as compared to a temperate environment. Now, due to this, it promotes niche specialization and leads to greater species diversity. Let us understand this term known as niche specialization. Students, if any organism is given a constant temperature, a constant supply of water and a constant and predictable environment, that organism develops special characters which are perfectly adapted to the environment. This organism will slowly become the master of its habitat and it will specialize the niche. Students, when many organisms do this, it leads to a greater diversity in the species. Also students, more solar energy is available in the tropics, which leads to higher productivity and which also indirectly contributes to greater species diversity. To learn more about this topic, download Top Scholars app.